What's going on guys? Mitch here and today we're taking a look at uh, some Elite Fly Ultralight Sport Bottles. Yay! Pretty exciting, right? Uh, not so fast. So a couple things guys. Um, as you guys know, the water bottle is often overlooked. So I'm going to put a couple of these away. I just wanted to show basically for a screen grab. Uh, a couple of these bottles. You will have seen these on my bike. And uh, they've been on the bike now for almost two seasons in a bunch of different configurations. Black, I think I've got some red ones, um, etc. But these are my first ones that actually have this, I think they call it a textured uh, kind of fit or finish to it, which is awesome because the ones that are smooth like up here actually over time kind of turn into this rubbed raw, raw dog style finish. So pretty excited to have that kind of pre-worn in. But let's get back to the main story here. So why on earth would we even look at a different water bottle? Hey, you know, Specialized has made uh, water bottles for just about every single bike company for the last, geez, 20 years. And uh, you know, if you look on the bottom of your water bottle, you will see it's probably made by Specialized and it's stamped in the bottom. Most shop bottles and company bottles have that uh, on the bottom. So Elite is not made by Specialized, it's their own brand. And uh, no word of a lie, they're half the weight of those other specialized bottles. And if we look at, you know, derailleur hangers, we look at, uh, you know, pedal axles, we look at ceramic speed uh, kind of pulley wheels, etc. And if we're looking at those little, little tiny places to save weight, um, you know what? Your cost per gram on those areas of the bike are substantial. Whereas something like this, you know, these bottles are 10 bucks. And you actually take a look on the bottom. There you go, 12 bucks Canadian. If the camera wants to focus, there you go, 12 bucks. So to save half the weight of a bottle, which uh, is you know pretty substantial in a lot of cases, your dollar per gram is through the roof on these. So just by switching to you know a bottle or two might not be a big deal, but it's something you're carrying anyway. You can save a little bit of weight, which I'm not going to mind. From a weight savings perspective, it's always good. But let's look at kind of the bottle itself. So I'm going to take a uh, label off here. Let's go 550. These are 550 and 750. Um, I use a variety of them from 550 on short sweet rides. 750 is usually the you know double bottle 750s. Or if it's a really long endurance ride, but I actually have a couple 950s as well. So almost a full liter per bottle, which you know, if you're going for five hours, you know what, sometimes it doesn't hurt to carry two liters. But it also kind of takes away the whole point of stopping for, you know, coffee, a Coke, uh, an entire family-sized box of donuts, or pumpkin pie, something like that. Um, let's get this unwrapped. So, nothing too crazy here. Let's pop that up, and then I imagine we can just rip it off. There we go. So, um, aside from the fact that obviously you know it's ultra ultra light and i'm going to weigh this to kind of show the difference and i'll grab a specialized bottle uh in a similar size and kind of weigh that in uh really like the grip top on this no issues you can open it without uh using a hand on the bike bite pull it doesn't leak as well so pretty good ergonomically i've never had an issue with the elite fly bottles they're also labeled i believe somewhere on them so just in case in passing 550 mils they say not to use them in the dishwasher, but I've had mine for two years and don't. Uh, actually, I do wash them in the dishwasher. So I guess the main thing, find an area of the rack that's not exposed too much to heat because they'll end up kind of just forming like that if they end up cooking, but you fill them up, they're fine. Um, I wanted to show you the uh, actual instructions on here in case you wanted to pause and read in your language. Uh, but it basically in English says Fly Elite is the world's lightest. Sports bottle used by the best world tour teams available in different colors. It is made when an innovative, orderless material. The result are, after three years of research, the bottle is sexual softness, blah, blah, blah. Anyway, so, you know, you might want to ask yourself too, um, why would you get different water bottle colors? And it's pretty simple. You're, you're carrying different water bottle items. So uh, sometimes, you know, it's nice to have different cap colors so that when you're filling it up on the counter, you go, hey, you know, maybe you want a red cap or whatever. Uh, or a red bottle and you go that's my that's my bottle and load up with sugar with melto with whatever and the other one's just water but it is nice to have options in that regard so let's get a weight on this bottle and just kind of show you how truly light this is with a with a big sticker on the bottom and then we'll weigh it and compare it with uh, a specialized bottle here 
So just, just for reference, guys, like it's, it's always good. I know it doesn't really matter, but let's change it to grams. So 33 grams for this 550, and with tag on the 750 shouldn't be much more. 44, so it's probably 40 grams on the, the bigger size. Let's go grab a specialized bottle, one sec. All right, and let's grab that specialized bottle. Same size, 66 grams. What was it, 33? 33 to 66 grams. So hey, look at that. First of all, props that I actually guessed correctly and said it was half the weight because I didn't actually know that. But uh, yeah, it is half the weight. On something that is the same price and honestly doesn't really matter a whole lot from a performance perspective. You know, easy to grip, easy to slide in and out. That's what she said. And um, you know, you're saving 33 grams for literally nothing. Uh, no wonder the World Tour riders use these things. I've uh, obviously not a world tour rider myself, um, but if there was a world tour for, you know, saving 33 grams, then uh, then I'd be definitely all over that. So I think these are definitely good value, you know, way to save some weight on the bike and a great way to uh, basically just hydrate during a ride. And the fact that you got three different sizes, uh, 550, 750, 950, and they might even have a 650. I, I just tend to jump through that one if they do have it, but I'm not exactly sure. Um, I think they've got a great little bottle, great little package here that uh, a lot of guys need to kind of get on top of. Uh, the other thing, keep an eye for sales because a lot of the times you can get these for like super, super stupid cheap. Um, I got these on a, I can't remember where, but uh, I got it on a website. I think they were half price when you buy like five of them or something. So I ended up buying six, I think. And just like anything over the course of a few years, you end up throwing them out because they shape, crack, break, whatever, um, you know what I mean? Um, but that's um, that's just like any other water bottle I need, really, so. Uh, but like I said, haven't had to throw any of these out quite yet, but it's always good to stock up. And uh, let's take a look on the inside here, just in case there's anything different. Uh, worth noting, I don't think so. Um, and actually, funny enough, I think ASOS, um, if you guys are ASOS riders, like I am, um, I think ASOS bottles are made by these guys because they're um, their bottle that came with like fully loaded branded cap and what or branded whatever for stuffing their uh, rain shells and stuff in your water bottle. That water bottle works with these caps. So that's a nice little thing to think about. Probably made by the same company. All right, guys. Well, I'll leave you there. I uh, probably talked for five minutes about water bottles, which I didn't think was possible, but uh, figured it was at least worth chatting about the, uh, the Elite Fly water bottles because they work so well. And I've had nothing but good things to say about them now for uh, a couple of years. So go buy yourself a few. I highly endorse them. And uh, unfortunately, I don't have a link in description that does anything for me to help me out in that regard. But uh, take my word for it. They're 10 bucks, 12 bucks Canadian. So like six or seven US. And uh, you're not going to be let down by them. All right. Save some weight. That's all we got for today. Have yourself a great week, guys. Bye. Peace.